Hello everyone, this is Dr. Abdul and I'm very glad to be with you today in a new video. Uh, today I need to answer your questions about uh, AutoCAD, how to get the software. Now, if you are a beginner, so you, you probably need to try the software and you need to practice before buying uh, the software. Uh, as a student, uh, you have several options. Uh, the first one you have uh, the 30 days free trial. Uh, let's see what does that mean here. I'm gonna list these links uh, in the description, so please feel free to uh, click on it uh, and get more information. Now, at the beginning, uh, we need to uh, to get the 30 days free trial, and uh, this is the link here, autodesk.com slash free trial. That will give you uh, 30 days to try the software then you can purchase it uh, if you want now if you are an eligible student you could contact uh, the school and get verification letter that you are taking courses of autocad and you are eligible to get uh, one year uh, of free educational license and you can uh, use it for the whole year and you can renew it if you are still a eligible student uh, so this is two options uh, the first one is uh, 30 days free trial and the second one a uh, student access if you are a student so you have this option and it is good for one year now what the system requirement before you install AutoCAD you need to know that uh, the system requirements uh, is for Windows and Mac are different. Uh, the first one for AutoCAD uh, 2022 include the special uh, tool set for Windows. Uh, now, uh, the recommended operating system is 64 uh, bit Microsoft Windows uh, 10, and this is uh, more information here. So, I'm gonna put again this link on the description. Also, the processor is very important the basic 2.5 to 2.9 gigahertz processor, uh, recommended a 3 plus gigahertz processor. Also, the memory basic 8 gigabytes and the recommended 16 gigabytes. Now, uh, this is other requirements if you're looking for Mac you will find uh, the requirements below uh, i recommend windows if you are studying uh, autocad i recommend windows uh, because we teach that in uh, the courses that i'm teaching all the courses we teach uh, using uh, windows and also if you're looking for uh, taking the autocad certification exam uh, so far it is in windows uh, it's not provided by mac yet now um let's see what uh, the process uh, i will show you how to uh, to get the the uh, autocad uh, educational license um, from get started so you will see later the step by step to install it but before that i will show you now in my account if i click on the top uh, you will see product and services uh, from product and services uh, you will see that uh, you have the old product and services and this is the AutoCAD we are looking for so you need to look for the version if you're looking for 2020 uh, that depends on your textbook or you need to uh, get the 2022 so you click on 2022 uh, then you get the AutoCAD including special uh, specialized uh, tool set you can get that and see the view included items you see several uh, items included but uh, what we need now for our course is AutoCAD this is the first one if you need uh, more you can uh, install a tool set now this is the AutoCAD that we're looking for for our courses and uh, this is the newer version 2022 uh, then you go to install now now I will show you step by step how to uh, create Autodesk account uh, then you will install it and what the step to install it and how to upload uh, the verification document so let's get started In this video, I need uh, to show you how to unlock educational access to Autodesk products that include uh, AutoCAD uh, this is uh, for students and educators. Uh, you can get free one-year educational access to Autodesk products and services and you can renew as long as you are eligible. Uh, there is a video here if you need to look at it, uh, how it works. Um, but at the beginning, I need to show you uh, this is the link. Okay, so you get to this link. 
and uh, after that you need to get started so you click on get started now you need to uh, get create account for the first time so we will create account at this time uh, we need to fill in this information i will put the usa united uh, states educational role you need to go here uh, a student uh, the institution type university uh, post-secondary if you are a college student so just put university post-secondary uh, then you need to put uh, the date of birth uh, so just fill in here your information the date of birth and um, just here fill it in and then you click on next and then here you need to fill in your information as well okay and here you need to put uh, your email uh, wherever the email that you are using uh, but be careful here that when you get the email you will get a uh, verification so the email that you will put here uh, you will access it to get the verification and you need to log in to that then you need to create password then you click on i agree then create account after that you will put the education uh, the education institution and this is the name uh, of your school when you start typing uh, it should come up so you choose the school let's say it's ashworth college so you put it if it's penn state you put your school or whatever the school that you are uh, in if you are a different school just make sure you are putting the correct school here then you need to put the enrollment like when did you enroll okay then you put uh, the expected uh, graduation let's say you put here the date and you should be current uh, like um, if this is before if you graduated already already you are not a current student so that will not um, maybe you're not eligible student so you should be eligible student uh, then you click next and at this point uh, your account is now updated to access the autodesk education community you need to check this hit continue okay now you will get uh, the software here as you see here we do have several software from autodesk if you're looking for autocad so you get uh, you click on the autocad get started and as you see here you just put the information um, if any of their information not correct you just uh, do it then you confirm let me for example if you did something not correct here you just need to go and uh, put that in and correct it just make sure uh, it is correct now confirm okay at this point you should be asked to uh, upload drag document here you need to ask your school uh, to give you uh, a verification letter and then you drag the document here you click on that then you uh, just upload it okay after uploading this um, I don't have the, the document to upload right now so after that you just click on submit and here you go you down uh, you are ready to install now after you get this and you're ready to install now you have uh, your account ready you got the confirmation email you need to check the email that you created your autodesk account uh, for confirmation and accept that email uh, then after uploading uh, the document you will get an email to um, verify that you are an eligible student and you can uh, install it and usually autodesk will reply like within 20 minutes uh, after everything is set up you have uh, a screen like that if you don't have the same screen so from the account on the top you will see product and services you click on product and services and uh, that will take you to uh, the screen uh, here we have uh, products update custom install uh, active trials like everything you uh, about uh, the software and also you have uh, the software listed if you're looking for autocad 
you have uh, AutoCAD student single user and uh, you have AutoCAD including specialist uh, tool set uh, click on it and uh, view item then as you see here we do have um, several kinds of AutoCAD we have the architectural electrical and all of that uh, but if you are looking for just the basic AutoCAD uh, which is several versions listed you can click on AutoCAD uh, choose the version that you want let's say that you need a 2022 uh, this is the uh, latest version you click on it make sure that the platform is correct you choose the platform and uh, the language then you click on install now and that will guide you through the process to uh, install it if you have mac so this is the autocad for mac you can uh, click on that and install it so you need to be careful uh, which one you are installing according to your operating system now after the installation you can always go to the product and services from the profile and uh, see the product details i hope that is useful thank you so much this is dr abdul and i will see you in a new video